Hi guys, Mikko here. How to learn French in Tinder. I installed Tinder recently and let's get this out of the way. This is not a tutorial. This is more like let's make mistakes and learn together. So, okay, I've been hanging out in France for a couple of months. The main reasons being surfing and learning the language. I applied to language school recently and that's been great. The thing holding back my language skills is the fact that I don't have local friends. All of my friends are from the language school and even though we share the mutual interest towards learning French, we mostly communicate in English. So something needs to be done. The best way to learn a language is to get immersed. The most convenient methods for this are for example doing a student exchange or getting a real job where you have to use the target language every day. Also many of my friends have learned fluent Spanish by traveling in Latin America where you just you have to speak Spanish or you won't get food or a place to sleep. That's not the case in here. I have a place to sleep and the locals speak English very well. I was actually a bit surprised because the stereotype is that the French communicate only in French. But that's not the case in Anglet and Biarritz. This is such a touristy place. During the summer the population grows four times bigger just because of tourists. Another great method for learning a language is to have a dictionary in bed, aka a girlfriend. And that's where Tinder steps in. And I know what you're thinking, like why Tinder? Why don't you just go out and talk to people like a normal person? Like It's way more fun and you get to practice the language immediately. And that is very true. But here's the thing, I know I could do it and I know I should do it, but I don't. So I choose to use Tinder. It's like training wheels. I've been feeling very introverted these past weeks and just the idea of going and talking to strangers and trying to make them to like me and it's, just, it's let's say it doesn't resonate at the moment. And another thing, I've never met anyone through Tinder not even while I was back in Finland. So this is kind of new and exciting. I did online dating back in the 90s when internet was a new phenomenon and reserved only for nerds. It was before digital cameras were a thing so many times you actually didn't see a picture of the person you're going on a date with. So <clears throat> let's say that after a couple of dates I decided to go back to the old-fashioned methods. Nowadays it's different. Tinder is mainstream and you actually get to see pictures. Like even, yeah, I know sometimes the pictures don't quite match the reality, but so what? The goal is to practice the language and everything else is extra. Okay, so I'm excited about this new toy. I mean language learning method. But there's a big problem. I've been swiping for a few days and I get no matches. These past days I've gotten maybe four or five but they haven't gone anywhere. And I know that if you're not getting matches the problem is probably the pictures. But I, I think my pictures are okay. Let's look at them. Uh, I know you want to see this. This is the profile picture. I think it looks good. Could maybe show a bit more of my face but I feel like I look attractive there. Then I have this. <laughs> I think this is just plain funny. It's me on a rocket skateboard. It's a cool picture and it shows personality. This was taken at the closed down prison of Kakola in Turku in Finland. The smoke is actually from a fire extinguisher. I like this picture especially because it sparks curiosity. Then I have a surf picture. Doesn't show my face but I think the picture is just amazing. Then I have this. You can see my face properly and I, I think it looks okay. My face, <laughs> I mean. This is my alter ego, Gangsta Pikachu, a Berlin-based anti-hero who's mainly about hustle. Again, I think that this picture is just plain cool and shows personality. Another one of me doing things I love with a strong backlight. This is also from Berlin. Me posing next to my home. The face is clearly visible and there's even a smile, so that's a plus. And finally an awesome shot of me doing a downhill longboard race. Me doing a thing I enjoy. Tell me what you think about the pictures. Maybe I'm doing something awfully wrong and I'm just blind to it. Might be. But I really feel I should be getting more matches with those pictures. Then there's the biotext. It's a bit long, but the short and funny setup 
punchline type of jokes aren't my strong point, so I made it a bit longer. Feel free to correct me on my French, by the way. Je viens de Finlande et je vis mon rêve. Je vendu tous mes biens. Maintenant, j'habite en un camping-car. C'est climatisé, ne t'inquiète pas. Aussi, je fais la meilleure café en ville. I come from Finland and I'm living my dream. I sold all my things and now I live in an RV. It has air conditioning, so don't worry. Also, I make the best coffee in town. Ma mission est faire le surf et d'apprendre le français. Je peux t'apprendre des grands mots en finnois à condition que tu sois gentil. My mission is to surf and learn French, and if you're nice, I can teach you bad words in Finnish. Je peux t'apprendre à faire du skate aussi, car j'ai cinq planches. Si tu veux avoir une conversation intelligente, je suis un acteur, donc je peux prétendre être érudite. I can teach you how to skateboard also, because I have five boards in my car. And if you want an intelligent conversation, I'm an actor, so I can pretend to be smart. There. Again, I'm quite happy with this bio text. It gives information, but it's also kind of funny. In other words, shows my personality. I mentioned the air conditioning in the text, because the days here have been quite hot. Anyways, feel free to give me feedback on the bio text. I'd love to hear it, because this profile doesn't give me matches. That being said, I have a surf date scheduled for tomorrow. But it's not really what I was looking for, because the girl is Swedish. <laughs> but she seems nice, so what the hell, why not? If we don't click, at least surfing is always fun. But honestly speaking, I'm a bit disappointed with Tinder and sure, I'm probably not the only one. I'll keep swiping, but yeah, my best bet would probably be to just go out and meet people the old-fashioned way. So, that's how you learn French in Tinder. You don't. <laughs> hey, I'll keep you posted. That's it for this time. See you on Wednesday.